Hello friends, uh, we are going to see now how to make the Topspin Junior model that is a basic rubber pod model. So uh, before we see the contents of the kit, see the additional material that you are going to need to make this model. So basically you are going to need the adhesive, uh, the furniture adhesive heavy coil and also the cyanoacrylic adhesive heavy pick. Then you need the cutter. You will need a set square that is 45, 45, 90 set square, a handful of coins, steel scale, the scissors and some perfectly flat surface like this. Now let us see the contents of the kit. See on the kit there are the two QR codes. One is for the instruction manual which you can just scan and see and another is the complete construction video. So from this QR code you can see the whole video any number of times. You open the kit and you will find that the kit contains say a piece of sandpaper then rubber and in the same packet there is one uh, sharp pin then there will be a propeller this is going to be your plan and inside the plan you will see the two things this is the two sides of the fuselage and this is the central part of the fuselage all lesser cut these are all the parts which you have to mount on the plan and complete your model and this is some lightweight tissue paper which is provided to you so these are the contents of the kit from which you have to build this uh, uh, excellent model of spin junior
take the propeller on the straight wire and rotate it. Now when the rotation stops, the blade should remain horizontal. Watch now. Now you see that one of the blades is heavier. So that is why it is remaining down and the another, the lighter one is at the top. So this is the imbalance propeller. Most of the time the propellers come imbalanced only. You have to balance it for the perfect flight. So you have to add the weight of the cello tape on the outer side of the lighter blade. So a few pieces of cello tape will be required to be applied over here until the blade remains horizontal when it stops. So take the piece of cello tape and apply it onto the propeller. Press it very hard so that it merges completely with the surface. If there is anything extra outside, you have to cut it. So keep on doing this until you see that the lighter blade becomes exactly equivalent to the heavier blade and the propeller remains like this. I have already balanced, it's a time consuming job. I have already balanced one propeller. I will show you how it looks. So see here, sufficient amount of cello tape has been applied over here. And now when I rotate this propeller, you will see that when the blades stop, they remain horizontal. So this is the indication that the propeller is balanced. So unless the propeller is properly balanced, never attempt any flight.
make the rubber loop you have to tie the two ends of the rubber strip now tying the two ends of the rubber strip is not a very simple type of knot it is a combination of two knots it is very difficult to see how i do this on such a small and thin piece of the rubber so i will be using the thick rope so you can see the complete process of tying the knot take the two ends of the rubber like this and then you have to first tie a knot together that means the way we tie both the ends together so this is the way you will be tying this is the first knot in case of the rubber in case of the threads or the rope this knot will go on becoming tight and tight if you pull but in case of the rubber if you try pulling this knot then this knot keeps on slipping and then the rubber ends will come loose so to stop that you have to take these two ends and tie one knot like this and the second knot like this so just like you tie your shoelace so this is the way you have to tie the knot and then this will be a non stick uh, non slip knot the extra ends which are uh, just uh, there you have to cut them with the scissors so in this light now you see this knot this is the way the non slip knot is to be tied it is quite important to tie this knot otherwise at the time of winding the rubber you are sure to lose the grip of the rubber on the knot and the knot will be slipping away for books by mr madhav khare visit www.rotsnaprakashan.com For many other products from paper gliders up to remote control planes exhibitions workshops lectures etc visit www.elerios.in or write to elerios.aeroclub@gmail.com